Hey guys, James here TCG University, coming back at you with another deck profile. Today we're going to do an E-Honda. E-Honda was one of the decks built for our Campus Championships 5-hander deathmatch week. Um, he did not last very long. Uh, in Travis's words, he was he thought the deck did nothing. Um, the deck still has some cool combos and some cool things that I can do. So uh, let me show you those and let's get into it. Okay guys, E-Honda is a 5-hand size 34 vitality character with all... Earth and Water. We're playing our deck under All today. He has two abilities, R once per turn. After your opponent plays a card as a block, seal it or seal one card, one non-character card in their staging area, draw one card. Uh, if your opponent blocks your printed five damage attack, they remove one, they remove the top four cards of their deck from the game. Um, he's a millish character. Gets to kind of like Control your deck speed. You have to either play slower and hopefully you have to play fast and not get milled out, or play slow and very precise. Uh, so let's get into the cards. Uh, we're playing two throw it down, uh, give speed and damage to our thing. If it deals damage because they don't want to block with the E Honda, we draw. If they do block, they remove. Seems it's really good. Same thing with why we play Pinky. Uh, e, commit, if your attack is not blocked, draw two cards. If it is blocked, your opponent draws one card. So basically, if they choose not to block, you'll draw two cards. If they do block, they'll remove four cards, and then you'll draw. they'll draw as well. Um, it's just really strong in making your opponent make choices. One second, Spirit Glass uh, forces our opponent not to be able to play certain cards in their hand. One Fiddlesticks to draw a bunch of, draw certain cards, and do stuff like that. Four Fatality, uh, remove problem cards as well as force it into momentum and use that momentum for later. Four Life, life Force Thread, it's a throw that gives us momentum. That has a speed and damage pump, gives the next thing speed and damage pump. Uh, that if we get to pick up is basically like dealing eight damage on its own anyway, so it's like a free, it's a free attack. Uh, four Sagaki, punish our opponent for blocking. Or just send a card that they don't want to block in general anyways. Because you'll pick it back up, play it again, and then you'll force their card out. Playing four Leg Crunch. It's a 5-3, four low for four. This says discard one card. It gets a speed bonus equal to the printed difficulty of the discard card. So you discard big cards that you don't need or just, just give it small amounts of speed. Get it back, play it again, make your opponent mill, stuff like that. It's just really, really good. And then three Zodiac, Raging, Raging Dragon Zodiac. It's the only card from Maxi that doesn't see a lot of play. Uh, Fury Punch, combo with any foundation. Um, combo E, discard X Momentum, ready X Foundations, and draw X cards. Uh, it's a four mid for eight that they block. You get to add back again and do, do cool things. You draw a bunch of things. You gain a lot of momentum in this deck. The idea is to just play a bunch of attacks if you can. As well as just mill your opponent out of, as a plan B if you don't get to kill. Uh, for Rhythmic Fighting Style, if you completely block something, you're removed from the game. Limiting all their options is a very cool thing to do. For Ozeki, forces them to mill, uh, remove more cards. For Fallen Master is a cool six, six check that lets us take less damage. Uh, Samurai Urbato is a cool spam that gives us more speed and damage. Profane Sanctuary is a mill card that forces our opponent to mill more. It's very strong. Uh, four Humanity Sentry. Uh, it's just a spam that we can pick up later to block with. Really, really good. Four Feifei to decrease speed and block better. Four Arranging a Deal to draw at Desperation if we ever get there, as well as it being a six. Three TK Mastery to check cards to make sure that we take less damage. Three Sins of Morris to protect ourselves from the uh, uh, stuns and stuff. Protects us from stun. Uh, three Well-Earned Relaxation. Uh, mainly for the bottom once per turn. Uh, after your opponent removes any number of cards from the top of their deck, they remove one additional card. This works on uh, cycling as well. Because it just it says after it happens. So your opponent, as a cycle like thing, has to remove the top ten cards of their deck. And it just forces them to remove three more. Also works really well with Honda himself. Uh, two high seas adventure turn off prong cards, prong attacks. Two com commander of the outwards armies face tank turn off prong card, 
Problem Foundations. One Secret History uh, to uh, turn off problem characters if we have them on, uh, on for our offensive terms. And then A Son's Love to try and get ourselves momentum and draw more cards as a five-hander. Thanks again for checking out the profile, guys. If you enjoyed it, make sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. Uh, give us ideas for what you want to see in the future. Uh, if you want to support us, go to patreon.com slash TCG University. And as always, guys, stay learned.